Hey guys, so today we're going to be installing the blow off valve on my 2.7 because I basically want to hear that swoosh, you know that everybody loves that sound. Well, unless you're like an old man and don't like loud things then, but you know, you get my point. So I'm going to go ahead and install this and I'm just going to do a little basic how to. So this is where it's going to go. Basically, you're gonna have to take these three screws off and you're gonna sandwich this between between here. So um, it's pretty basic. You're gonna need these little, let's see if it focus. They are, you know, you're gonna need an E5 socket, which is basically little star shaped socket because that's what these are so the first thing you want to do is you're gonna to want to go ahead and disconnect this you just pull it back and it should just pop right out and then just keep it out of the way and it's just time to rock and roll Okay, so there's a little slight offset if you don't align it correctly. So you're gonna have to, you know, just rotate it until all of them align. All right, so once you align it, you're gonna have to use the screws that are provided. Once again, you gotta align it with There you have it. All you got to do is reconnect the plug. Now, just got to go ahead and I'm just going to go ahead and zip tie this here. I'm just going to go ahead and zip tie this up here, just using the, these loops. May not be pretty. But keeps it in place. There you have it. it is installed secure now let's take it for a drive see what it sounds like So there you have it, the installation of my blow off valve. Hope you like it and uh, make sure you like my video and go ahead and subscribe. I'm going to be doing a bunch of DIY um, videos coming up soon, so stay tuned.